What's going on guys, welcome to AFC Game by Game and in this video I'm going to be discussing a player who has been kind of outcast by Arsenal recently, Lucas Podolski. Now we all know how much of a class player he is and we all want to know why he isn't getting any, any starts for Arsenal at the moment. Now I can't say that I honestly know why he isn't playing for Arsenal, I think he's a class player, I think when we brought him in from, Col from Cologne last year I thought he was a class player then. But he's not underperforming, so why isn't he starting in the team? He started that game against Coventry, scored two cracking goals, and worked his socks off in that game. Every time he's come off the bench, he's looked really good. And bringing him on for what, five minutes in that game against Southampton, I think it was a bit of an insult to him, uh, really, from Wenger. He's not getting the respect he deserves. Um, and I think, you know, is it fair to say Wenger's ruining his footballing career? I, I don't know. If he's going to be continued to play on the bench then yes, honestly, I can say that I think Wenger is kind of ruining his career a bit like he did with Arshavin, a similar kind of player we brought in, very promising for the first season, and then just gets put on the bench and he's kind of wasted. I don't want that to happen to Podolski because I think he's a, I think he's a world-class player on his day. He's absolutely phenomenal. And if he's to be wasted on the bench, especially when it's World Cup year, that's, you know, that's heartbreaking for him, really. And honestly, if this is going to continue to happen, then I want to see him sold in summer because it's not fair on him. And it's, it's, you know, it's just not fair on us fans really to have to see him suffer. But I don't want that to be the case. I want him to be integrated back into the Arsenal team and I want him to be playing. He offers us something different, which a lot of the Arsenal players can't. I think especially whilst Fiat Walker is out, he can relish a lot of the chances that come in the games. And it, he's, he's got that deadly left foot. He's a deadly player. No defence is going to want to play against a guy like Podolski. He's ruthless. And if you look at his goals and assists last season, it tells you all you need to know about the kind of player he is. Now, I don't think he's a striker, I think he's a left-sided player. Simply because when we've played him as a striker, he, he just, he's been non-existent in the game. It's like we've been playing with 10 men, he's been that quiet. In, in a, a Cardiff was a notable game where he basically didn't turn up in that game. And, um, you know, if we are to play him, play him on the left-hand side, I think that's where he causes most problems for the Pets. He's got a bit of pace to his name, he can cross the ball, and he can finish all from that... Um, area of the pitch. I mean, I think we play in a style which is more suited to a Nicholas Bentner or Olivier Giroud kind of player, the type of big man in the box, the guy that's always going to be there for the crosses and the headers, whereas Podolski is always the guy that should be providing the crosses, etc. And, and the assists. I think that's what he's best at. Whether he's a striker or not, whether he played there for Cologne, at Arsenal, I think that's where he works best and that's where he plays his best football. So, I want to see him, I just want to see him play more. It devastates me that he's not actually getting a chance in the team. Because he just he works so hard every time he comes on to prove Wenger wrong, to try and prove his point. And even if he does play well, we just, as Arsenal fans, we know that he's only put on the bench for the next game. And I just want him to play so much. It's, um, you know, it's not good enough really from Arsenal. I just want to see him play. It's, I've said that too many times now, but it's a fact. I think every Arsenal fan wants to see Podolski play. And I just wish him all the best, retrospect of what happens if he's still here in summer or if he's gone. I wish him all the best for the future. I hope he has a decent World Cup. You know, he's 28 years old, so he hasn't, in terms of footballing years, he hasn't got that many years left. I mean, he's, I'd say he's got maybe four or five of the most years left in him, and, you know, he, we've got to make the most of him whilst we can. I mean, he's a player that is just so crucial to this team, and until Wenger opens his eyes and realises that, then I don't know what he's actually going to bring to the squad. Anyway, those have been my thoughts on the Lucas Podolski situation at Arsenal. Please leave me your thoughts on this one. I really want to know what you think about the, the whole situation with Podolski, whether... You know, he's had a disagreement with Wenger because he's not in the team. Just, just let me know your thoughts in the comments box below. If you have enjoyed the video, it would be great if you click the like button. Subscribe for more videos. And as always, thanks for watching, guys.